Today is the 25th of March 2020. Um, as of yesterday, Ireland, well, technically today, uh, Ireland is pretty much in essential lockdown. So everyone's been restricted to stay at home. No more than, I think, four people out together. Um, unless you're going to work or essential travel to hospitals or whatever so it's not easy schools have been extended their lockdown until for another month almost um, so it's tough it basically means that i am stuck in my home for at least four weeks two kids and the missus um, so for a lot of people it's tough but I'm trying to see the sort of the upside to it I'm trying to see this as an opportunity um, opportunity to video like this to sort of document what we're going through what it's like I do hope to maybe <clears throat> someday go into town to see how quiet it is so compared to what it was before and maybe hit some areas that that would have been very busy and are now quite dead almost um, it's also an opportunity to do lots of chores around the house that I have been sort of put aside due to not having time or just busy with everything else um, but the main thing is I guess we've always talked that Donna would love to go off and study to be a healthcare nurse, to work in an old folks home or something like that. Um, and that, so she would be full time doing that. And then I would scale down from being full time to being part time. So then I'd be the stay at home person to look after the kids. And you know, some people see that as sort of a step down, but for me, it would give me an opportunity to do more of these kind of videos to work on building websites to do stuff um, as sort of a side job so, you know I do a few photography gigs here and there so that the few days you know on the weekend when she's not working that I would go out and do these gigs so at least I'd have something but then during the day when the, she's in work and the kids are in school I can work on websites or general content creation online so I'm trying to see this time off these next four weeks as an opportunity to get started on that and um, so that if I do end up going back to work I can at least work on some of the stuff on my days the few days I have off you know on the weekends um, or at night when the kids are in bed and then I can start building it up and then that way, when she starts going back to school in September, I may be able to have built up enough of a website that I can scale back my days of work and I can start doing that so that by the time she is um, working full time in the old folks home or whatever, I can scale back to just being part time or just leaving work altogether and I'm not worried about having to then start building up the websites. I already had them built up. So I'll be able to get going straight into the content creation. Um, so I'm not completely starting from scratch. I do want to try and use this as an opportunity um, to do more of these videos, to document sort of what's going on each day. Um, and then to try and start on these websites. And also to start getting into that routine as of if I am home with the kids, you know, again the routine of schoolwork, lunchtime, great getting dinners ready, um, and doing all those chores with the kids and getting them into that routine as well. Because that's what that's what's gonna be, you know, eventually down the line that is sort of the aim that I will be sort of a stay-at-home dad. So being stuck at home for at least four weeks is a great opportunity to give that a try run. 
so I'm trying to get in start so today's main plan is to start setting out some sort of guidelines or routine of what we're going to do each day um, I have a list of things that I need to do I tidy up the kitchen and cut the grass cut the hedges um, this is starting to get brighter the grass is getting longer it's not as main as much uh, then I need to sort of set out routines for the kids so you know trying to get them up at a certain time Matthew to do his homework getting Oscar to try and get into stuff he's gonna start getting party training soon so as we get into this new normal I'm trying to sort of see this as a positive opportunity um, there's lots of things I want to try and so I'm trying to organize my time so that's what today's plan is to try and get things organized so that I can have time where the kids are doing stuff and that I can do more of these videos talking about what we're doing and um, there's a few things that other people the likes of Cody and Pete and Maddie I'm talking about uh, they're doing their daily vlogs there's some challenges going around Colin Smear doing the weekend film fest again so I'm hoping to sort of have enough have time to do them as well there's lots of things to be doing so there shouldn't be quiet moment in these four weeks you know the only thing is but the fact that we're stuck in the house so fingers crossed I can do all these things I can stay within my house for most of them I should be able to do that um, but I think it will be important to at least go out for a drive with the kids every now and again just to try and get them out of the house you know see we have the garden but they still want to go out other places and see other things so we'll show them around, a small bit, within reason, of course. So, we'll see how the rest of the day goes. have to try and cut it down but also lift it up to get in at the bit that's actually pulling the weight not the main roots that are at the back
Your jail. Yeah, for bad guys. And sound. Yep. Go up. Police team, get ready to move out. So it was a pretty busy day. Got lots done. Trying out lots of new things with this video. I'm not sure what the video is the audio is gonna be like. Or the light, I'm sure it's changed a lot. Um, kind of like this setup here. It's nice like a spot in the couch. But I'll have to work out how to line it properly. And then hopefully the audio is okay. I think I'm gonna sign off now for tonight. And hopefully I'll see you all tomorrow. Remember, stay inside, stay safe, and wash your hands. <laughs>